Turkish Delight or Lokum is a family of confections based on a gel of starch and sugar. Premium varieties consist largely of chopped dates, pistachios, and hazelnuts or walnuts bound by the gel. Traditional varieties are often flavored with rose water, mastic, bergamot orange, or lemon. The confection is often packaged and eaten in small cubes dusted with icing sugar, copra, or powdered cream of tartar, to prevent clinging. Other common flavors include cinnamon and mint. In the production process, soapwort may be used as an emulsifying additive. The origin of the confection is not well established, but it is known to have been produced in Turkey as early as the late 1700s, hence its name. History The exact origin of these sweets is yet to be definitively determined, however, the word lokum comes from the Arabic al halkum in the Arab world, Turkish delights are called Rihat al Hulkum, Rihat al Hulkum, which means, throat comfort. According to the Hasi Becker Company, Becker Effendi, named Hasi Becker after performing the Hajj, moved to Istanbul from his hometown Kastamanu and opened his confectionery shop in the district of Basakapi in 1777. He produced various kinds of candies and locums, later including a unique form of locum made with starch and sugar. The family business, now in its fifth generation, still operates under the founder's name. Tim Richardson, a historian of sweets, has questioned the popular attribution of Hasi Becker as the inventor of Turkish delight, writing that, Specific names and dates are often erroneously associated with the invention of particular sweets, not least for commercial reasons. Similar Arab and Persian recipes, including the use of starch and sugar, predate Becker by several centuries. The Oxford Companion to Food states that although Becker is often credited with the invention, there is no hard evidence for it. Name The Turkish names lokma and lokum are derived from the Arabic word lukma tea, and its plural lukum meaning morsel and mouthful, and the alternative Ottoman Turkish name, Rihat ul Hulkum, was an Arabic formulation, Rihat al Hulkum, meaning comfort of the throat which remains the name in formal Arabic. In Libya, Saudi Arabia, and Tunisia it is known as Halkum, while in Kuwait it is called Kabed Alfers, Kabded Alfers, and in Egypt it is called Malban, Milban Malbayan, or Agameya and in Syria Raha. Its name in various Eastern European languages comes from Ottoman Turkish Lokum or Rihat ul Hulkum. Its name in Greek, Lukumi Lukumi, shares a similar etymology with the modern Turkish and it is marketed as Greek delight. In Cyprus, where the dessert has protected geographical indication PGI, it is also marketed as Cyprus Delight. In Armenian it is called Lokum. Its name in Bosnia and Herzegovina and Israel is Rahat Lokum, and derives from a very old confusion of the two Ottoman Turkish names found already in Ottoman Turkish, indeed this mixed name can also be found in Turkey today. Its name in Serbo-Croatian is Ratlik, a reduced form of the same name. In Persian, it is called Rihato el Holkum, Persian, Rat al in English, it was formerly alternatively known as Lumps of Delight. Around the world Europe Bulgaria In Bulgarian, Turkish delight is known as Lokum, Lokum and enjoys some popularity. While it presumably came with the Ottoman Empire, it may have arrived earlier, as the Middle East has been very influential to the country in terms of cuisine. Bulgaria produces its own brands of lokum, which may be plain or spiced with rose petals, white walnuts, or endresh. Greece In Greece, Turkish delight, known as lukumi, lukumi has been a very popular delicacy since the 19th century, famously produced in the city of Patras, Petrina Lukumia, as well as on the island of Syros and the northern Greek cities Thessaloniki, Ser and Komotini but elsewhere as well. Lukumi is a common traditional treat, routinely served instead of biscuits along with coffee. In addition to the common rose water and bergamot varieties, mastic-flavored lukumi is available and very popular. Another sweet, similar to lukumi, that is made exclusively in the town of Ser, is a canase. Romania The Romanian word to describe this confection is rihat, an abbreviation of the Arabic rihat ul holkum. 
However, in the Romanian language, the word rehat took a pejorative sense, in this case a euphemism that translates as shitty. According to linguist Lazar Sanianu, Turkish words which entered the Romanian language in the 17th century and 18th century became mostly obsolete and acquired a pejorative or ironic sense. Politically and socially, this weakened the influence of Ottoman society, and parts of the Ottoman Turkish language which had not had time to take root in the Romanian language took a touch of irony and became a mine for humorous literature. Rehat is eaten as is or is added in many Romanian cakes called kornuli, kozanak or salam de biscotti. Albania and former Yugoslavia in the countries of former Yugoslavia, Serbia, Croatia, Bosnia and Herzegovina, Montenegro, Republic of Macedonia and Slovenia, as well as in Albania, Turkish delight is known as rehat lokum, ratlik or lokum. It was introduced during Ottoman rule of the Balkans and has remained popular. Today it is commonly consumed with coffee. Rose and walnut are the most common flavorings. North America the Nori Candy Company in the Greater Los Angeles area has been producing Turkish delights or rehat locum since 1964. The company produces different fruit and exotic flavors including rose and licorice as well as a variety which include nuts such as almonds, pistachios, and walnuts. In 1930, two Armenian immigrants, Armin Tertsagian and Mark Balaban, founded Liberty Orchards of Kashmir, Washington, and began manufacturing applets. Apple and walnut locoum, and cotlets, apricot and walnut locoum. In 1984, they added the medley flavored fruit delights line in strawberry, raspberry, orange, blueberry, peach, cranberry, and pineapple assortments. Although all of these confections are marketed under American style brand names, they are referred to on product packaging as rehat locoum. In Canada, the Big Turk chocolate bar made by Nestlé consists of dark magenta Turkish delight coated in milk chocolate, and is marketed as both Turkish delight and lukum. Brazil The confection is known in Brazil as Monar Turco, Delicia Turca, Bala de Goma Síria or Bala de Goma Arabe. As with most Middle Eastern dishes, it came with the Levantine Arab diaspora to Latin America. Britain and other Commonwealth nations Fry's Turkish Delight is marketed by Cadbury in the United Kingdom, Australia, and South Africa and can also be found in Canada and New Zealand, which is rosewater flavoured, and covered on all sides in milk chocolate. UK production controversially moved to Poland in 2010. Protected geographical indication Despite its worldwide popularity and production in several countries, at present, the only protected geographical indication PGI for such a product is the name Lukumi Jeroskipo, Lukumi Jeroskipo for Turkish delight made in Jeroskipo, Cyprus. Related products Turkish Delight was an early precursor to the jelly bean that inspired its gummy interior. There are gourmand perfumes that are based upon Turkish Delight, such as Lukum by Ava Lux, Lukum by Keiko Masheri, and Rehat Lukum by Serge Lutens. In popular culture Turkish Delight features as the addictive confection to which Edmund Pavensi succumbs in The Lion, The Witch and the Wardrobe 1950, by C.S. Lewis. Sales of Turkish Delight rose following the theatrical release of the 2005 film version of The Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, The Witch and the Wardrobe. Turk's Fruit, a 1969 Dutch novel written by Jan Wokers. Turkish Delight, a 1973 Dutch film about the love story of an artist and a young woman. Turkish Delight is the name of a song from second chapter of Act's 1980 album entitled, The Roar of Love. See also Big Turk, Botan Rice Candy, Gyuhi, Gumdrop Haji Bay Halva Mazgati
Turkish cuisine Food portal References External links Media related to locum at Wikimedia Commons Turkish Delight aka Locum Web Article